A group under the aegis of Edo Civil Society Organization in Edo State have faulted Governor Godwin Obaseki for not signing the ban on open grazing into law. Speaking to a reporter, Friday Pomujero in Benin City, the coordinator, Dr. Sadolo Oche, said 11th of May 2021, Edo State Governor and other Southern Governors held a meeting in Asaba on the need to ban open grazing in the region and issued a communique on open grazing ban. Oche noted that the ban on open grazing was unanimous decision by the governors in order to address the high rate of insecurity which open grazing has posed in the region. The governor said yes in that meeting. And the meeting was held on Tuesday. Wednesday, 13th, he went to Abuja to hold a meeting with the president and was demanding money for a national livestock transformation program. Was that the agreement in that meeting? No. If he signed a communique with his co-governors, in Asaba, and they re-echoed it in Lagos. Did they agree that they are giving federal government land for national livestock transformation? No. If that is not the agreement, then it's between the people of uh, uh, those states. So we will not tolerate betrayal. He must listen to us because we voted for him as a governor. And the purpose of calling for that dance on Britain is to know our feeling. Stand and allow one man think that he will make a decision, not knowing what's happening on the grassroots. If you want to fund the the the, the elders, what about other businesses in agricultural line? What about the, the, the poultry, the rabbitry, the fishery? You want to fund just the cattle? Are you telling us the youth, all of us, who put head into cattle only? What about other other areas? So it is not proper. It is not done. If he called a town hall meeting and we unanimously agreed to a certain resolution, why did he go behind us and do something different for the people? If he's telling them that he wants to work with the mind of the people, why doing a separate thing entirely? So we are standing as one. We don't want Ruga in those states. We don't have lands for headers. Because we know their antecedents. We know what they can do, what they are, what they are capable of. What we are saying is, if ranching, if rearing cattle is a private business, the same way having a poultry is a private business, let them go source for funds to take up themselves. When it comes to pastoral farming, we need, we don't need open grazing. It's an ancient and it's an embodiment of evil. We reject it in totality. We don't need it. We need what is current. What is current is ranching. And that ranting should be a private business. It's not the business of the government.